Hello everyone and welcome back. First of all, I need to thank you for this. Yeah, that's freaking good. Thank you so much everyone that have subscribed. And now we just have to watch my videos like 3,500 times more so I can get some money for it. Hey, cut, 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 cut. Uh, this is not about money. We're no interest in that. We just do this show because uh, it's fun to do. And but if you really like it, it would be pretty nice if you could watch uh, around 3,500 hours of it. Uh, yeah, that would be great. But uh, now let's get back to the video. Uh, yeah, so today I thought I'm gonna show you some figures I have started to print and paint so I can have in the trucks, like drivers and some uh, people standing around here and there. So it will look cool in videos. And they were really easy to print and Actually, really fun to paint. I'm not good at it, cannot say that, but the, the, as far as I got them, it's really fun. So, yeah, I thought I'm gonna show you that because I have printed them all on my Ender 3 Pro, so no problem if you're not uh, a perfect chronist. So, yeah, let's uh, find out how that looks. <laughs> so, say hello to this guy. I don't have a name for this guy because he's too big for my truck. So this is uh, how they look. And I know it's far from perfect. Here are the support bin. You can see on the arm all the stripes here. But it's printed on the Ender 3 Pro. So I'm actually kind of impressed. And the good thing you can see here that I have lightened some fire on him. Because then you can uh, remodel arms and stuff and legs and everything to get them really sit good. So that's uh, how they look from the printer and when somebody have used a lighter on them. But here we have the rest of the gang so far. This is the driver for the Cross 260. It's a bit smaller than 1 to 10, I think. I'm not sure. It's really hard to make uh, scale right. So I'm just going for what looks uh, good in the cabin. As you can see with some colors. It's on some a bit far away. It looks really nice, actually. So this is the first figure I ever painted. You can see that in that haunted ice. Yeah, that's kind of scary. Let's uh, see it like this. I'm gonna cut you! I'm gonna cut you with a knife! I'm not a psycho! You are! Look at me! Look in my eyes! <sighs> yeah, that's, that's just weird. And then we have the rest I have tried it painting here. This is my latest guy. Perfect to have. With the Kras dump trucks videos and stuff like that. He's not finished with the paint yet, but having these guys standing around on the videos I think will look really great. And not, uh, well, still kind of scary face, but not exactly like the first one. And then we will have. Oh my god. Are you alright, miss? <clears throat> yeah. What, what the? Stand there, girly. Good. Here we have the guy that would work in the woods when it's time for some log videos again. I will try to get this close to get a more worn out look. I'm gonna try that in a bit. And then we have my clickbait girl. So yeah, this will be in all my thumbnails. Nah, not all, but some, because clickbait. So that's how they look, all the guys I have. As you can see, he is a bit smaller th than the rest. But he will fit perfect here. I'm just gonna put him in. He is a bit struggle getting in, but there he is, in place. As you can see, that don't look so bad. Hard to see, of course the light, but yeah, that would be a perfect stuntman for Boris in there. So.
So now I thought I'm gonna try to weather this guy a bit and let's see how that turns out. So let's see, two minute weathering. So the helmet is a bit dirtier and the chainsaw looks a bit more. This needs also need to dry, a lot of sweat. And some darker blue jeans, just give it some more structure. And if we don't, then put him here. We got a truck driving there. Brrrm. Then he will look really good on the videos, I think, in the future. So, yeah, and this is the color I have used on this one. It's a uh, Valio, maybe. I used this, find it on Amazon pretty cheap, so I just tried it. And yeah, you can mix them together and it get them a lot of color you need. So yeah, that will be some fun things to have on the videos in the future, I hope. So, and uh, if you want drivers and stuff like that for your rigs, I really recommend buying this. I will leave a link in the com or in the information section to the Cult 3D page where I find all these uh, guys because they work really good on the and the tree so I mean if you want this and just want some driver that looks good when you're one two meter away from the rig then they are perfect so yeah I recommend that try it and yeah that was all now I just gonna leave see you later everyone I see you made it to the end of the video. Leave a comment and a like and maybe subscribe. Otherwise I will hunt your dreams. <laughs>